this button I think is an actual touch button. Oh, no, 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 don't do it. Don't. Is it gonna, oh no. channel if you're new here hello my name is Kay I'm a professional home organizer and soprano here in the Boston area and I'm here to inspire you to live a more organized life so it's Tuesday morning I just finished a big project for something and I am super relieved but it's noon and I've been doing that like all morning so um, it's time for me to take care of the house today the house is a little messy I've got plants to water laundry to do all that stuff but I really want to prioritize and today I'm gonna be working on the bathroom because, well the bathrooms, because both bathrooms look like trash and we're gonna get them to look good today. We also gotta take Clover for a walk. <laughs> He's begging for it. So we're gonna go for a walk and we're gonna go buy home goods and see if there's anything fun there for us to buy for the bathrooms. I already bought stuff for the bathroom, so it, you know, I always wanna check to see if there's more cuteness. So this is what the master bathroom looks like right now. Um, when we moved here, we moved everything from our last condo here and as you can see, this rug that's supposed to go underfoot, it does not fit the double vanities because it's much longer. So I bought an, a longer one from Marshalls and I'm gonna move this one into the other bathroom maybe? We'll see, we'll see. I'm um, gonna keep this here. I mean, maybe we can shove that over here. You know what, not really sure. Definitely gonna keep this rug, I love this one. I mean, I can switch them out if I'm feeling, you know, like I need to wash one and switch out switch out for the other one. Maybe I'll do that, a little, do a little alternation, alternation game. Hello. Look, it's got these big mirrors too. Love these, these are good. And we can look at the guest bathroom, which is a bona fide disaster. So um, the guest bathroom, it's got a similar um, vanity, but it's, this one has drawers. I don't know if they, they didn't put drawers in the master bathroom. What's in here? Soap, okay, well, whatever, nothing much in there. Uh, but of course, we're gonna clear the counters uh, and figure stuff out here it looks it's a disaster <laughs> gotta figure that corner out gonna put some of this stuff in storage because it's like leftover shelving actually I'm gonna put that in the coat closet and then we've got like this business over here which needs to be dealt with and I'm gonna hang a shower curtain and just straighten this out and underneath here I'm gonna you know what we're gonna be we're gonna be totally honest actually I bought this for this cabinet look works great but like look underneath here wow I mean it's not that bad but like it could be better so this is where we're gonna keep our linens and stuff um, like towels and all that business, maybe. We'll see. Um, but for now, we're gonna go and check out uh, what's outside and what's in home goods. Cause uh, the stuff I bought for the bathroom, like the shower curtains and stuff and rugs are in here. So I have shower curtain liner um, and I got another uh, shower curtain. And what else is this? Oh, this is another shower curtain. So I got shower curtains so I, I could switch them out. Um, and here's the rug for the other bathroom and then like the curtain hooks, all that stuff. We're gonna go back to Home Goods and take a look around, aren't we, Clover? Because we love it. We love it. The fan is so loud. Um, the washer and dryer is here too. I'm looking forward to getting this space looking really nice so that we can like live here, you know what I mean? So um, let's, uh, Clover, are we ready? Let's do this thing. Okay, we're back. I had some lunch. I had some Pirates Booty. <laughs> and um, I got a little thing from Home Goods, which I think would be cute for the bathroom. So I'm sorry I'm running the laundry, so it's a little loud, but um, this is a like, cute little laundry curtain. Look at that. It like just fits because there's a little like space between, you know, before you open the laundry door. But like it says, and I normally don't like this stuff because I think it's cheesy, but I, I don't know. I kind of like it. It's a self-service laundry open 24 hours. It's very cute. Um, kind of farmhousey, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, um, I took the stuff that needs to come out of here, out of here, I'm gonna remove those boxes, and we're gonna figure out what's going on with this cabinet. This might be my linen cabinet. And that will be the laundry stuff, and maybe this can be something else. We'll see, I'm gonna mess around with here, and then I'll show you guys afterward. But for now, I think, because I've taken all the linens out of the master bathroom, I wanna clean in the floor in there, but I definitely wanna set up my new um, Roomba. So, you know what, let's open it. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday! Okay, gangling, we have the Aerobot Roomba S9 vacuum, robot vacuum. So, get excited. Um, this is a robot vacuum, but it comes with this little, like, 
little thing. And it empties its own dustbin, which is amazing. Amazing times. Um, and so this is how it does it. So you know what? Let's go ahead and just open it. We're going to open it. Clover's going <laughs> to... Clover's going to get upset again. What? Clover, are you okay? You okay, bud? Okay. Ooh, this a big box. All right, get ready. You'll, to start, you'll need to... Your, uh, all right, to start, you'll need your robot charging station and power cord. Okay, we'll just set that up over there. Um, but I think we'll have more than enough space. So we're gonna go ahead and unpack the box. Wow, there's a lot in this box. So cool. this is the robot, so we'll take this out. So same size as other robots, but different shape. As you can see, well, from the box, you can see that it's like kind of a weird, it's got like one flat side. So I heard that that was a really good innovation that they did with this robot. Clover, <laughs> you got a ball. I see you with your ball. I see you, we'll play ball on it later. Okay, buddy, just in it, I have to unpack this robot. Ooh, wait a minute. I didn't realize that it's gonna be so beautiful. So, wow. Oh, cool. So if you really wanna empty the dustbin yourself, you can, I guess? Oh, this thing is awesome. Oh, you can empty. <gasps> You could, wow, that is so much better than the other design for the old Roombas, where you just had to like go like that and it was a nightmare. Um, this, this is, this is slick, my friends. You can take your old, let's see, does this just pop open for the, wait, <laughs> flip open, and then what about the filter? How do you get the filter out? Um, you just pop this open. Oh yeah, pop that open. Grab the filter. Okay, cool beans. This is slick, y'all. Do y'all see Clover? Do you see him? Here you go. Unbelievable. Um, this is cool, this makes it, oh, wow. Okay, I am super happy right now. So, as you can see, very cool design. Um, automatic dirt, dirt disposal, that's where the, Dirt gets sucked up and through, I guess. Um, oh, wow, I'm excited. I'm excited to run this puppy. Well, I gotta charge it first. So we'll go ahead and, okay. <laughs> we'll go ahead. It's like every video with Clover in it is just him like just like bringing the ball, the ball and being like, can you, can you get this? We'll take that out. And I'll put this aside. power adapter and everything looks like okay so this is the vacuum bag that I keep <laughs> this is the vacuum bag that goes inside the dispenser I think so we'll put that back in there it goes a power cord and an extra filter I love that they give you an extra filter so anything else in here no nope, that's it okay Oh, there's an extra set of brushes too. That's awesome. Because um, these brushes that are on the bottom of these machines, sometimes they wear down. So I'm glad they give you an extra one. They should for the price of this machine. All right. <laughs> so let's put all this stuff aside. Thank you, Clover. Thank you for your ball. I appreciate it. Here we go. Go get it. Go get it. Okay. And now we have the biggest thing of all in this box is this dirt, the, well, the, the dock and the dust bin thingy thing. <laughs> These are technical terms. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh, Clover, I almost stepped on your ball. Let me move this out of the way. Here you go, my friend. Okay, we'll unpack this puppy. I don't think this will be too bad to set up. I think it'll be really nice, actually. Because um, I've set up now three of these robots. Now actually for four of these robots, but only three of them I set up online. Um, this will be my third one. So they're pretty easy to set up. Okay, well, I think it's going to be hard to unwrap this. Okay. All right. 
give me a sec. Okay, here is the dock where the Roomba is going to reside. Nice and slick, just like boop, goes underneath there and I guess this is where the dust gets sucked up into, I suppose. I don't really know. All right, well, I'm gonna set it up in the place where I'm gonna put it and we'll, we'll set it up. <laughs> showing up on camera or not, but there's a little, there's a little light that's happening here. Um, I'll get the camera closer so you can see it. See the little light that's going around and around. Oh, it just turned off as just as I said that. That's convenient. Oh, there it goes again. So it's illuminated. Oh, it's awake. So let's set it up. So these machines work with the iRobot app um, and the app is actually pretty good. It's a pretty good little um, app and it works like 99.9% .9 of the time. I remember like one day, like the iRobot cloud or whatever was down and people were freaking out. Like the people were on Twitter like, I just want to vacuum my house. Nah, 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 nah. So it was like super fun. Like the, the feedback on Twitter was so hilarious because people were just like really mad about like just not being able to vacuum. And it was, it made my whole day. I'm like, people are really mad about this. But it was like, it was fixed after like, I don't know, like eight hours or something, but it was down for a while. Um, so let's go ahead and add a robot. Searching for robots. Oh, they're like, whoa. Okay. Wow, that was the, these are not like real buttons. They're like touch buttons. This thing is like very fancy. Um, wow, you are just like my dream. Okay, oh, I forgot. I'm gonna have to put that like thing in there to collect the dust. Oh, Clover, who are you barking at outside, bud? Wow. Sir, who are you barking at? Okay, I need to put a bag in here. Oh, there's a bag in here already. Okay, how does this work? All right, cool, there's already a bag in here, so I don't need to put a bag in. That's just awesome, I can just use it whenever. All right, Rosie is connected. Once Rosie's connected to Wi-Fi, you can start and schedule cleaning job. Please connect. <laughs> Who are you barking at? Who are you growling and barking at? I wanna know. I need to know. <laughs> there's nobody out there. It's just, a. it's like literally nothing. Get him. Get him. You show who's boss. Oh. Get him. <laughs> Hello, handsome. Hello. Are you guarding are you guarding the living room? You're doing a great job. Doing an awesome job. Okay, it's totally set up it's still charging so i'm gonna give it some time before i give it its first job but um so far i'm in well it hasn't done anything but i'm impressed so far just by um the way that it feels um this is a much more premium machine i guess than my other machine and it's beautiful like these buttons are like touch buttons and not like depress buttons this button i think is an actual touch button oh no 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 don't do it don't <laughs> Is it gonna, oh no. Wait, well, I didn't mean to. Um, oh my gosh, inadvertently started it. Well, um, I'll, no, you know what? I'm gonna send it home. I'm gonna let it charge some more, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it's pretty loud though, actually. It's, well, they're all pretty loud, so we'll, do, we'll just send it home. Uh, we'll see how well it goes home though, before I send it to its first actual job. Let's see, here we go. Sorry, Rosie. I started you up prematurely. All right, there she goes. Go on home. You can do it. And she's really getting set up here. Oh, interesting. 
Get in there. Get in there, girlfriend. It should be like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. All right. Well, <laughs> I'll let it charge some more and then I'll let it do its job. Okay, since I've taken all the linens out of the bathroom, well, except for these, I'll take these down and replace them with new ones. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and give the bathroom a good clean. There is some white pieces of paint that don't come up when you scrub, but come up when you scrape, you see, um, that I'm gonna go ahead and remove from the floor. This is gonna take me a long time, because see, there's like one right, oh, actually, we'll see how many are there, but like, you know, this like drives me crazy, and see if I can scrape the, grout as well. I have a grout brush. We'll see if I can get it nice and clean, but I'm going to give the bathroom a good scrub down for, you know what, and I really hate to admit this, but this is just the way that it is. Really, since the first time that we've moved in like a month ago. Oh no. So, um, yeah. Anyway, let's get started. When I get you back, oh yeah. When I get you back, oh yeah. I promise you'll never leave me when it comes to you and me. There's no one else. I'd rather be with Baby, I won't let you down I got it I know you need it Love is it when you're around Oh, please say That you believe it Cause I don't wanna lose you I hope you feel that way too No, I don't Okay, I've gotten most of the little like white bits off the floor, except if I can't, let's see, is this one? Okay, that one I can get off the floor, but um, some of the, it's just so, so irritating, but most of them are gone. I can probably continue to do this <laughs> for hours and hours and hours and just fill my time, but I think that I will go to the other bathroom and do the same thing. <laughs> Hello, it's the next day. Uh, I did so much work. I just, I couldn't keep the camera running, the battery died, but we got a lot done and we finished the second bathroom and the first bathroom, so I'll take on a little tour. I'm not done like decorating, but like there's no like junk in it. So we'll go and look at the second bathroom. Oh, but first a little progress report on my Roomba. I set up this Roomba and ran it for the first time yesterday and I love it so far. It's 
amazing. I'm gonna actually run it after I finish um, filming this video. Um, it's pretty loud, that's, all, that's the only thing I will say that's different from the other Roombas is that this Roomba is very loud, but I feel like it's doing an exceptional job. Like I feel like the suction is like great. So mop is there, Roomba is there. Probably not the best place for the mop, but whatever. Clover, are you? did you do something? What happened? Anyway, look, second bathroom all set up to be a bathroom. I'm gonna turn on the light and show you around. So we got this shower curtain that I got from Marshalls. It was not expensive. I think it was like 20 bucks. It might need to be ironed or steamed or something. Actually, I can steam it. It'll probably be nice. It's all steamed, but it looks cute. And I got a little like diamond, um, mat to go with it so i thought it was kind of like a nice continuity of pattern there um and i put the other mat that was in our main bathroom in here so now the counter is a little bit cleaner this is my husband's like phone soap i hope he moves that into the entryway when we get our console for the entryway but whatever um so underneath here i just put cleaning supplies and um, it's sort of like our linen cabinet and Clover's bathing grooming area. <laughs> so we've got so just some home decor stuff and like this is linen, bed linens, this is bed linens. I might just get rid of those boxes altogether, but for now they're fine. Uh, we got Clo <laughs> Clover's like, is this my stuff? Yeah, so it's your stuff. We've got Clover's like grooming stuff. It's like razors and, um, toothbrushes and shampoo and stuff because I'm gonna use this bathroom as the bathroom where I give him a bath because we have a bath, a dog grooming room in this building, but it's not that great. So um, I bought one of those little hoses that you can hook up to the, the faucet in the tub, like this faucet and use that as like a doggy bath. So we're gonna do that. Oh, put a couple of body care things in here. Nothing really special, but like and I cleaned the bathtub because they've had cardboard boxes in there for four weeks now. So hopefully that'll be a functional bath for us now. Oh, um, oh, we'll get back, we'll get back to under here. And then just um, basically some cleaning stuff, like some paper towels to clean the bathroom with and some bathroom cleaning things, extra toilet paper, um, and some bits and bobs, pieces of, uh, I think the pieces of the vacuum. Is that, is that pieces of that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's like vacuum pieces and things. Um, and also just some like disinfecting business there. It's cleaning, it's like a cleaning closet. It's not like super pretty, but it'll do the job for now, right Clover? Yeah. Okay. And over here, we've got the laundry cart that I filled up. I think it looks really cute. I didn't take the tags off yet. Scissors right there, I should take the tag off, but. This laundry cart was $50 at Marshall's, so it wasn't super cheap, but it's really cute, and I, um, it's metal, so it is filled up with all of our laundry essentials. It's got our tabs, or pods, or whatever. We got some OxyClean, and then like the fancy laundry, laundress stuff. Um, and we've got, you know, the dryer balls. This is for microfiber. Cloths. This is called Cora Ball. It catches microfibers so they don't go into the oceans and rivers and stuff. And some stain stuff. And under here, <laughs> Clover's in every shot. You guys love it though. Under here, we basically, this is where all the microfiber cloths and things go before they need to get into the wash because microfiber gets its own uh, wash cycle because it's special. Clover, what, what's, what, what's happening? <laughs> because here's the washer and dryer. Just on top, you got a few other laundry like backup things, like the the, uh, the rest of the package of OxyClean and like the extra bathroom rug, some paper towels, and um, oh, that's the little like it's a what's that? It's a portable clothing rack. Oh, sir, 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 what's happening? Oh, I know what's happening. One of his toys is in here to be washed because it had some soap on it. Um, and I didn't want him to eat this soap. Clover, I'm sorry, I'm gonna wash this before I give it to you. I'm sorry, oh he thinks I'm gonna throw it. I'm gonna put it on top of here before I wash it. Just so he's not gonna get all distracted by it. <laughs> Do you want another toy? Oh my gosh, my husband bought him this hilarious toy yesterday. It's a TV dinner and I think it's so funny. Look, 
You can put this in there. <laughs> Where's the egg part of this? Oh, here it is. There we go. And he just gets them out. <laughs> and they squeak. At least, at least I hope they squeak. This one's not squeaky, but this one is. Get one out. There you go. Go for it. <laughs> Who loves this? <laughs> go do it. Wow. We love to get him food. Theme toys are pretty funny. You go for it. Anyway, I gotta clean that little pizza because it had soap on it. Um, you can put your dog toys in the washing machine if you don't know. You can put cat toys and dog toys in the washing machine. They usually dry pretty good too. Sometimes the squeaker gets a little bit of water in it, but it, they wash pretty well. You're not convinced? I moved, I moved it up there. Anyway, this closet has, well, it's not a closet. It's a, it's a cabinet that we've had in three apartments now. It just has some extra laundry business. It's got like, this is a soaking tub if you need to soak a piece of clothing. It's collapsible, uh, but if you need to you need to rinse something, um, guys have some collapsible bins down there, extra towels, um, extra laundry stuff, and the steamers there, essential oils, and we've got the hand towels and actually Clover's robe when we wash him so um because <laughs> he gets he gets cold when he's drying he's air drying i don't blow dry him just some extra little like bathroom linens and that is a really cute little solution there so the bathroom looks really good and i got a lot of the paint splatter off the floor but there's still some around so i think i'm gonna have to um work harder to get it off of the floor clover what are you doing in that corner Hello. On the back of the door, we also have the iron and the drying rack, uh, just like in our last apartment, but it wasn't in our bathroom. Okay, Clover wants to show you the master. All right, here is how the master turned out. Got the new rug in here, much longer than the other one, just basically like the other one, but longer. Uh, we removed some clutter from the counter. I don't know what, why my husband has that hand lotion out, but you know, <laughs> whatever. Uh, I moved the, I need to get some more uh, I think, what is this like? It's oil or it's whatever, diffusing stuff for that. So the bathroom smells good, but this is actually a, um, a light, a night light for the bathroom. So if you have to wake up and go to the bathroom in the, little, in the middle of the night, it comes on. It's a motion sensor, it's pretty cool. Got a little holder for extra toilet paper because the extra toilet paper is in this closet behind that door. And if you're on the toilet and you run out of toilet paper, you're not gonna wanna get up and go over there, could be a disaster. So spare roll there. <laughs> it's a little holder that you can put on your toilet tank. It looks stupid, but like, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, right? <laughs> anyway, um, then we got the, you know, the new shower, we got the new shower curtain up and I thought I got the shower curtain specifically because of this cool pattern on it. Like it's got this sort of fringy kind of thing going on, but it also has this cool stitching on it and that stitching, actually really well matched. Ooh, it's not a focus. Okay, it matched really well a stitching on these towels. Isn't that fun? So I basically, you know, I've got a little theme going on. So I thought that was really cute. So here is the master bathroom. I definitely think my husband is due for another scale. Cause that scale, I don't know, it's not that cute. It's not that cute. But anyway, master bathroom, very pleased, very happy, finally, organized and uh, I got most of the paint off the floor in here as well. I hate that there's paint drops on the floor. That's so annoying, but like, what are you gonna do? All right, so that's it for this week's vlog. Um, we finally got the bathroom done. I'm so excited. Cause like, ugh, so it walk. it's so nice to walk in there and be like, it's a bathroom. Yay, finally. <laughs> so um, I hope you guys are having a great morning, great afternoon, great evening, wherever you are. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.